106. Going dog. Why, hello, everybody, and welcome back to my favorite map that is a reserve. Um, so, you know, this was not a bad spawn. Um, it could have been much better. Um, today I was just hoping to uh, head over to the bunker and, yeah, get after that. Some, some bunkerage actionage with the old uh, Vector 45 ACP. I don't know what uh, ACP stands for, by the way. I, 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 don't, I don't think I've ever even like heard what that stands for. Like I, I don't think it's even something I've forgotten, if, if that makes any sense. Which that kind of sucks that there's no way down to the bunker from here. You actually have to, like... At least to my knowledge, there's no way down from there. I think it's like the White Pond, Black Pond. I think there's... Away from the queen building, there's away from the dome. But actually, that could be our D2. Is that? that could be the D2 bunker. Saw that a little late. Blacked out my arm in one shot, though. That's kind of nuts. Big bolty. I don't know where exactly that was at. What? I'm seeing like occasional muzzle flashes, but that's kind of it. I'm just gonna leave. Hope everybody's doing well, though. I would normally chase that down, but I think that's just a scab with like a car or something. A uh, car 98, and he just got a lucky uh, arm shot on me. I know I'm already short a bullet in my magazine, but I figured it'd better to use the pistol, because, well... Whoa. Why is this one of the biggest... Whoa, that was like, that is a weird... Okay. Normally, I don't get anything. I mean, like, anything from this room, but it's, now I get two MK17s. ECP FMJ. So it's all terrible. It's all garbage. I'm boring. I brought my damn... I brought my vector to have some fun down here in the bunker, and there's nobody here. What in the boring? I guess we can go check the other bunker or something. Kind of a strange moment. I don't really know if I should have my vector out or if I should have the RSAS out. I'm very liable to get into a long-range gunfight here. And actually, while I'm here, I may as well check the other, um, what's it called? Mark room. I think it means that there's no way down from there. I have to go to a whole loop because I can't remember... remember the direct way to, uh... That was the whole mag? That's kind of scary, honestly. That is that's that is quite ominous. It didn't feel like a full mag's worth of ammo. Uh, I certainly hope that is not foretelling a... Pr oh, fuck off. We're telling a problem for the future here. Oh. Dick. Worthless ass ammo anyway. He was barely doing anything to me, man. He just had to be a, he had to be that guy. He just didn't want to survive that encounter, I suppose. What a dick. I hear you. What in the hell is that? <laughs> sure, I suppose. 
Let's see what this guy had to bring me. Well, 11. He's a $250 gamer. Uh, there shouldn't... There shouldn't be any keys I don't know about, which is kind of interesting. Not that I have, like, the, um, all keys examined thing, but there's just not a lot of keys. That's why I'm confused. Whatever, though. All right, we're gonna go ahead and head down to the old, uh, bunkage here, and... I think it's in Black Pond. I think it's downstairs Black Pond, but I came up from Black Pond, so... I'm sure I would have seen it, no? Did I really just look the wrong way? Am I just stupid? We'll go get all three of the, uh, marked rooms. This, this map is kind of unique for that ability, or er, ability, pardon me. Um, for that, where it's got, like, yeah, three marked rooms. And I mean, I may be wrong, but doesn't every other map only have, like, one? Technically two, I guess, if you consider the bloody rusted key. That's very good. And I'm just trying to save some uh, weight. We're going to go ahead and head right. We're going to go all the way around. We're going to follow the train tracks up. And we'll see what's going on in that other bunker. Like the, the food storage bunker, I guess. And then um, head over and out. That guy with the big gun is still up and out here somewhere. It's kind of freaking me out a little bit. Oh, fuck off. I'm telling you, man, there is nothing on this planet scarier than the damn AI with grenades. Always check the backpack. Or always check the wallets, just in case. Um, I'm not gonna take that. I had to genuinely sit there and think about it for a second, though. I was, I was tempted. Weird. A little bit. And it's kind of spread around everything. Um, hmm. Hmm. Ah, okay. Forgot to bring her to put another propital in my thing there. I only give myself two. I probably grabbed one out of my, uh... Oh, lick my nuts. Grenade. I'm just looking for this scab that I bopped from like a quarter mile out. Hang on. I'll get to turn in a second. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You motherfucker! You brother! I'm sure that scab is still downstairs. Oh. Yeah. That felt good. And that outside. Oh, 
Nothing, nothing really good to loot, so... That was very interesting, uh, but I'll take it. Damn, these bo these guys both had grenade launchers. Yeah, that guy is just that guy is a walking menace. There was, pardon me. This was a scav with some very expensive shades. Guess we'll go ahead and head back. See what's shooting at me back over here. He was folding my shit right there. He just kicked my ass. Weird that this guy was so dedicated to just sitting there holding that angle. Here's somebody creeping nearby. I'm too committed to the loot though. It's a good thing I found an injector's case, because apparently everybody and their mom brought every single shit injector they can. Kind of a slow start to this raid, but it has picked up that also. <laughs> Honestly, that was kind of funny. I thought that that was a shotgun. Also, this is the... That's kind of embarrassing. That's ten bullets. But it's the best ammo for uh, that stuff in the game. I need to find some more k -lock. We're going to go ahead and head over to these other... Uh, Things. These other, or the other bunker, excuse me, and then we'll see. Oh, that's trash. I feel like I had plenty sufficient jump to get over that. I should have turned on the power. Actually, it doesn't power only stay on for like five minutes or something? Got a time gate on it. That's five, four, five, seven, and forty, I think. Yeah, it's like the second best. Uh, 545 ammo in the game. It's kind of cool, actually, to just see it out in, the, out in the wild like that. Scared him. I never found that guy with the SV-98, by the way. Just totally remembered that guy. I had completely forgotten about him until right now. Alright, the guy have you lived to die another day. Not really worth much. Well, I, I don't think he was worth the bullet I shot at him. I mean, like, his entire net worth... It's probably not equivalent to that bullet. Everything he had on him. Why is that fire so unusually bright? That that just like fully distracted me. Like somebody could have walked up and just killed me right there. I wouldn't even notice. Let's uh, mark him really quick. See if this guy had anything valuable left on him. Looks like a guard. Let's know when we uh, check the pockets, you know. Just your standard scav. Third and final. Wait, what do you mean I don't got room for a six beer? <laughs> this game. This game don't seem to understand. I've always got room for a six beer. Might get rid of this Glock, but... <laughs> By God, I got room. You know what I mean? I got room. Unfortunately, I don't have room for that P90, though. That, that does kind of suck. And actually, I don't even need that mag. I can just get rid of that entirely. I don't use these mags. At least anymore. Yeah, I've got a bigger mag than that. Uh, I don't plan on keeping this, but I'll keep the mags with it. Just in case. What else is in here, though? we got an RDN. RGN, excuse me, RDN. Did I just say RDN? A raven right in front of my face, a Veritas. I think that's it. And. No, something's right here. Oh, 
what's the shotgun shell? AP 6.2. Okay. Overall, kind of a mid haul. Usually they're actually a little bit better than that. Anyway, we'll just go ahead and uh, check out that bunker and then we're gonna leave. Hopefully the train is coming by by that point though, so we can actually take the take the train out of here in style. Oh, I knew something down there already. Having given it some thought, I'm going to open with this. Someone came down here before me. I hear the big fight going on. I just don't really know what to what to prioritize. If that makes any sense. Oh, <laughs> look at that. Um, where are we? Where do we think that guy with the SV-98 was? <laughs> I might as well look for him while I'm here and then we'll just leave through. We'll go to the dome from here. It was a guy who had surprise contact for his own, I think. You honestly wouldn't believe me if I told you how I saw that guy. Actually, you may believe me. I just saw his flashlight. Straight up. Like the, the white outside glow of his flashlight. The hell is this guy? I'm just kind of committed. I already, I already sent rounds this guy's way, so I'm, I'm, I gotta go get him now. I still can't believe I couldn't find the guy with the SV-98. I'm kind of, I'm, I'm, I know it sounds stupid because it's like, what could he possibly have on him? He's a scav, but like, you know what I mean? It's kind of about principle at that point. Always check the wallets, boys. Always check the wallets. All right, whatever. We're gonna, we're gonna head over to the dome and get on out of here. Yeah, let's go do that. It's been it's been long enough. I don't know how long this raid has been to this point. Probably been like 35 minutes, but we'll, we'll just get out of here. I'm gonna have to go hit up Shoreline after this. I was kind of looking for like a ton of PvP, and I remember the last time I came here, I killed like seven PMCs in a matter of seconds. Like it was like off spawn. It was kind of funny because I was super ill-prepared for it. I had the MK-18 Mjolnir or whatever the hell it's called, and it's like... 
Oh, that train's already leaving. New train go boom. Um, yeah, it was a mule near, so I only had like 10 rounds at a time. I was very ill prepared for like any physical or uh, any fights, you know, but uh, somehow still walked out on top of that. I don't know if that often has something like in it, those uh, underneath safes, but I never seem to find anything in those. Oh, my God. I'm sure that that's expensive. I don't... No! No! I had something up here. I had the crow, and I lost one of my, uh... RSAS max, dude. Fuck. Oh, f Well, shit. Yeah, we're just leaving it. I wouldn't even... I wouldn't even know where to begin. And there's already a fight going on down there. I'm just gonna get out of here. It's super unfortunate, because I... Okay, hang on. Something big is going on down there. I might actually have to give that a check. Why is it that every time I hear something big going on, I come to check on it and it just calms right down? Yeah, whatever. He's leaving. We're leaving. But hey, you know, that was a good raid. We got quite a bit of gear. We got quite a bit of stuff out, so we're, we're, I'm, I'm happy with that. I'm, unfortunately, you know, I lost like three grand worth of... <laughs> you know, that's actually pretty funny. I was going to say we lost like three grand. Remember that scab? I think the one that I literally shot the one bullet at, I reloaded just to repack that one round. And that I think that was where that even went. Because there was the guy. Or yeah, no, it was the guy that I killed that had like nothing on him. The check your, check that wallet guy. He only had like five grand on him, which is not enough to cover the, the, the bullets I used. That's pretty funny. Yeah, almost 40 minutes and not a lot happened. It was a PMT? I missed who? Well, hang on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So, so basically 10 PMC kills. That's, that's fine. I don't care. Whatever. These things happen. But uh, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you in the next one. Uh, you guys take it easy and peace out.